Okay, uh, yeah, let's go. I think those are all that we can do for now. We have to go to individual areas specifically, like the Crimson Mire lands and stuff like that, to do a whole bunch of other stuff. So let's just go and, uh, let's just go over there. But I want to do the, the one thing. Uh, what is it? Uh, okay, so we got to go to, I think, the Coronet Highlands, I think. I don't know where exactly I need to go, though. I know we're close. So we got to go to the Clamber Claw Cliffs, which is over here. So just head to this camp for now. We're going to accept as many requests as we can, and we're going to see if we can do them right off the bat. Uh, I need this. Oh, yeah, Bell Alpha Pokemon. Uh, yeah, so I have caught the the Alpha Sligu from the Crimson Mirelands, which was level 50. Uh, it was level 50. And when and it has the same evolution as a normal Gudra, where as long as that area is raining, you're able to uh, evolve it. I have to switch my Pokemon. <laughs> Oops, I don't want to rest. I want to switch my Pokemon, please. Thank you. Uh, let's see here. I need my two Pokemon that I actually finally named after so long from not naming them. Uh, we get to actually finally see it. Empronup. It's a it's a mixture of all three of the evolutions. I don't know. I always kind of like. Uh, I kind of liked it, so I kind of went with it. And Tojeri as a uh, as Togekiss, because I like that one a lot too. Uh, where am I going? I'm going up here. Hi. Okay, so we're we're here now. So we're looking for Where am I going? Oh, I'm going down there. What? But this is okay. Investigate. All right. I do not have status conditions, so this will be a little bit difficult to capture, but it should be fine. As long as the level is pretty high. Oh, what's that? Uh oh. What is that? I don't know what that is. Oh no. Is that it? Nope. Game. Where is it? Oh, it's over there. Come on. Hey. Does it just not like me to lock it onto it or something? Uh, I don't understand. Am I supposed to try and throw Pokeballs at it or something? There you go, buddy. I don't know where I am. No, I don't understand. How are you supposed to do this? I don't get it. Am I supposed to try and throw my Pokemon around where it is, maybe? 
it's how I triggered most of them in my Pokemon battles. Uh, Arcanus, come on. Arcanus, come on, man. Uh, I'm a bit, uh, I'm a little bit confused here. Maybe I need to see it do a Pokemon. He needs to see me do a Pokemon battle. A uh, Bronzor, okay. I don't get it at all. Boom, there we go. Alright. Hi, Darkrai. I can't even start the battle. Uh, if I find that I won't lock on, I'll just throw my Pokeball at it then. I can't even start the battle. My, my, Arcanus, come on, man. I don't understand. I'm a bit confused here. Here. Hi, buddy. Come on. Oh, come on, man. Did that actually work? No. I don't get it. I literally don't get it. I kind of need to heal, though, so... Maybe I'm supposed to throw a berry at him? Here, have an orange berry. Do you like orange berries? Hi, buddy. <laughs> hmm. Come on, buddy. Maybe I'm supposed to wait till he gets weakened a little bit. Here, have a berry. No, he doesn't like the berry. Oh, what? Don't do tracking. Come on, man. That's not nice. I don't understand how to catch this dark guy. Doesn't make much sense. I don't get it. Yeah, I'm targeted by a wild Pokemon, so it won't let me do it, okay. Hmm. I have no idea what it's doing, to be fair. So the thing is, is that it's not letting me keep it. Professor, do you have to say something? Record my phone. Thank you? It's not really what I'm looking for right now. Looking for some advice for that. No, I'm looking for some advice about Darkrai, man. Hmm. I have no idea. Are you supposed to, like... Are you supposed to like let it just t like tire like get it t uh, like uh, keep using moves to get itself like exhausted? That's why I wanted to go back so I can get healed though, so I can actually like do it. I want to see if he can sneak up behind it and challenge it that way. There we go. Finally. Alright. It's level 70. Okay, then. Uh, I'm gonna go with Iron Head. Alright, Arcanus. Iron Headed. Nice. Dark Void. I'm going to be drowsy. That's fine. I'll try throwing a Pokeball now. Uh, go Pokeball.
At least now it's not going to take like three Pokeballs to kind of do it. I don't know what was wrong with Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl though. Like we caught legendaries pretty quick. Never mind. And apparently this game too. What? Astounding. Now everyone will be able to rest easy. Yes, now no one else will fall victim to such dark nightmares. I suppose I'd better be heading back home myself now, but I won't ever forget what you did. Farewell, young one. I don't understand. Why is it that newer... Like, I, I think I said this before when we were going up here or, like, we were at the Alpester Icelands or whatever, but I feel like I somehow stumbled upon, like, a hidden mechanic in Pokemon games where if you just keep using Pokeballs, you get a higher chance of using it. It's like how a lot of the new gacha games, if, you, if you've ever played a gacha game, it's sort of like how their pity system works. Or if you keep throwing Pokeballs, eventually you'll just catch it because they'll, the game will take pity on you and will just let you keep it in the Pokeball forever. Hi there, buddy. What do you want? Well, thank goodness you passed by. Please, I need you to help me rescue my feel. Its adorable round body caused it to go rolling down the hill and is headed straight for the Stone Tooth Rose and the Boulder Roll Cavern. Those areas are full of dangerous Pokemon. You're that new Survey Corps member everyone's been talking about. Well, I'm pretty much an old member by now, by the time you get to here. Please help me find my dear Sveal. All right. Well, sorry, buddy. I gotta go do the other thing, though. The token of gratitude. Speak to Medi at the Fieldlands camp to learn more about her request. Sure, we got an XP candy large, though. Who should I give that to? I think an Empernup, though, just so they're, like, it's a little bit more well-rounded. But I want to give it to Arcanus, because Arcanus is a starter. Is our is our new starter, I should say. Not actually the starter, but it's our new starter. Actually, wait, wait, wait. Hang on a second. Uh... Okay. So you have to see use moves. And you have to see use different styles of moves. Gotcha. That's not too bad. I, I like the fact that legendaries are like that. You caught one Pokemon. Care to report your findings? Yes. Do I get a bonus because it's a legendary or mythical? No. But you should. You should, game. You should give me a bonus for that. And some new observations. Yeah, I made two, apparently. Were they both dark eyes? Oh, they were both dark eyes. Okay. Oh, but the research points counts as doubled. So instead of, like, getting 10 or something like that, you get, like, 40. It's not interesting. Again, still know that you can switch locations. That's so weird, though. Like, why wasn't that one of the key things that like, you can do in there? Well, we have to go to the Heights camp anyway. I think, right? Alright. Uh, I apparently need to talk to someone here for the story. I think. Wait, where do I need to go? Uh Oh, I need to go to this camp. Okay, but I was supposed to go to this camp for something too. Is it you? Oh no. Oh, I need to talk to Volo. He's over there. I see him now. Uh no, I don't want to go there anymore. I want to go over here. Uh who do I need to speak to? I need to speak to you. Oh, you're the Diamond Clan member that I saw here. Hi there. Ah, you must be Dramore, right? Hello, I heard about you from Mai. Thank, uh, thank you for taking on my request. I'll get right to the point. Uh, once when I was in the... Once when I was little, I got lost here in the Obsidian Fieldlands. I was wandering across... I ran in tears when I stumbled across a field of beautiful flowers. That's where I met it. A Pokemon I'd never seen before. It gave me a flower and then set off walking. As if to guide me somewhere, so I followed it. And it led me back to a place I recognized. Thanks to that Pokemon, I made it home safely. 
but I never got to properly thank it. I'd like to find it again and tell it how grateful I am. The only problem is I haven't been able to find the wet field of flowers. I feel the flowers, so I'd like you to help me. Here, this is the only clue I've got. The flower? The Quercidia. A flower is sometimes bundled in bouquets to convey gratitude on special occasions such as birthdays or anniversaries. That's called the Gracidia flower. It's the same flower as the one that Pokemon gave me. Please find the field of Gracidia flowers here in the Obsidian field lands for me. I don't remember seeing any. I actually quite literally don't. Uh, there's a place in the Florora Gardens or Flor Floro Floro. Yeah, Floro Gardens, where it has, like, a dead patch of flowers. Could that be it? Like, obviously, it they're all dead. But, I mean, like, could that be where they were at some point? It's gonna find... Hopefully, it's not a daytime check. If it's a daytime check, like, the Darkrai one was, like, nighttime, then that's gonna be really weird. This thing. Yeah, is this it? It was? No way. It seems to be the flower field Medi has been looking for, but they're all dead. Is this the field from back then? They're all dead. Look at them. They're all withering. Flowers may have maybe withered, but I remember these surroundings exactly. This has to be the place. It's so sad. Excuse me. Can you hear me, kind Pokemon? A long time ago, I got lost out here and you guided me back. I don't know if I'd have made it home without you, so I just came to say thank you. <laughs> thank you so much! 